what's going on y'all so we're here with another gigawatts team if you saw my last video we used gigawatts's chancy shuffle team and got absolutely destroyed by some absolutely ridiculous matchups like being minus six chancy and still getting hit by everything uh we faced a baton pass dub wool team that absolutely destroyed us um we faced another team where minus four chancy still got hit by a tailwind and things of that nature so just all in all like really ridiculous stuff and i'd rather try a team that i don't have to try ridiculously hard to pilot like you still have to use skill to pilot a team like this but it's it's easier so um i hope for some better success with this team uh, if you have not checked out Gigawatts' channel before, they are a very good friend of mine, um, fellow content creator, really good at giving me feedback on how I can adjust the EVs uh, and things like that on my team to account for like the big four or some of the threats of my teams. So yeah, definitely check them out. We do a podcast together as well with Random Gaming BGC and Andy Love EGC. So, you know, check out that kind of stuff. Uh, subscribe to my channel if you're not I appreciate it subscribe to gigawatts I didn't know that you could actually put like a just subscribe to this person up on top of the screen but you can so check their channel out good times um, and so let's talk about this team for a second this team is a Calyrex shadow team with weakness policy which not everybody is expecting so if you're not gonna proc your own weakness policy there's a good chance that someone else will, which is kind of nice. But you do have Brutal Swing Oranguru, Oranguru, uh, to do that. Um, Brutal Swing, Instruct, Ally Switch, and Trick Room. Uh, it's the boys. Um, inner Focus cannot be faked out. So you do have a free Trick Room if Oranguru survives long enough. Uh, we actually have three different Trick Room setters on this team for a little bit more assurance. We've got Rage Powder with Volcarona for some redirection. And we also have Life Orb, Sucker Punch, Pinkerchin with also, you know, Electric Serve, Rising Voltage, and Scald. So Rising Voltage does fat damage on Electric Terrain. Electric Terrain allows you to stop yourself from falling asleep. And we also have Urshifu to help clean up some of the other really annoying things like Fire Pokemon and Rock Pokemon. So this team's got some good synergy, um, and I'm hoping to see some good success with it. We do have wide guard in, or we do have protect instead of wide guard. Um, yeah, my my ranking literally got destroyed by using that Chansey Shuckle team. I went from being 20 and 14 to 20 and 17 now. So, like, let's not let's not use teams that just destroy my ranking when I was in the top 2,000 and now I'm in 5,500 like it's just not what I want to do at all <sighs> evasion is supposed to work that's all I'm gonna say like didn't I literally just face this team um, hmm. I kind of like starting pink with in here. Um, I'm gonna say we start Pinkerchin stack. I think that puts the most pressure on them. Um, or actually, let's start Pinkerchin Calyrex Shadow. I think that puts the most pressure on them because they're gonna wanna fake out Calyrex really bad, I would say. And then we bring Stonky Tonky in the back, Stonka Tonka Truck. Um, Urshifu is actually pretty good here. We can bring 
I, I actually feel like Stonky and Oranguru is probably my best. The problem is gonna be if they magically, you know, and they could, I'm not gonna say they can't, like, they could just fake out my boy. And they could also lead, okay. This move's power doubles when on electric terrain. Scald. So rising voltage actually will do more damage here. What I want to do... Actually, they can't reset the terrain. So... You would get a crit. That's a good play. Like, that crit is definitely not great for me, though, I will say that. even playing that bad like I don't feel like I am
this person is so <laughs> I mean, from what I know about Gigawatts, they like to build slow game teams. Um, that person just quit. <laughs> so, we were gonna get the Trick Room again, and that's why they did that. Because, I was gonna guarantee myself to get the Trick Room again, and, what could they really do about it? Like. You've only got so many options, bud, like... This is a cool team. Ranguru stack as a lead. Um, So here's my thought process. If I get rid of the Pinkerchin, I think I'd win. Or, it's not a they tell this is spiky boy. You know, like, they're both spiky. Toji Demaru. That's what we'll call him. We'll call him Pico. Go, Pico. The fact that they didn't start Pyko puts me in a little bit of a rough position. It's fine, like, it's fine. We use Brutal Swing, we try to pick up a KO with high Hunt's power. And if we do, then we're in an okay position. Ooh, that's bad.
I don't like this person already. They might have air balloon. Oh, it's probably Sash though. Nope. Okay, so that sets us up for success a little. They don't have a good switch in for Suicune. Yeah, you would, you would make the right play. I'm going to say this works. There we go. There we go. <laughs> so what did I say in the beginning? If we get rid of Toja Demaru, we win. And what did we do? We got rid of the Toja Demaru. Okay, okay. Let's give it one more. We're earning our stripes back. Pinkerton, hear me roar. <sighs> I 
I like the Orangaroo Pinkerton start here. I think what we want to do is trick them into thinking we're going to use Trick Room, make them set up the Trick Room for us, and hopefully we see some decent success out of that. What I could also do... No, this is fine. I was gonna say I could actually lead Urshifu. Um, because Urshifu... I actually don't know if Urshifu can get rid of Stack Attack with... 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 Surging Strike. Am I okay with just letting a Ranguru go down? <sighs> Set up the trick room for me, please. It's your destiny. It's your destiny. I read into it too hard. I read into it too hard. Either way, we got two good wins in this video. That's what matters. Oh my god, this might not be enough. Okay, it will. a lot. 
it's way too much. Like, how can I act? How can I realistically come back from that? If they have Rillaboom, they should bring it out. And then. What choice did I really have? Like, I set myself up for failure in this game. This is me. So that was a really short match. I didn't play it well. Um, I really wanted them to set up the trick room for me. I very well could have ended up flinching from the rock slide. Um, yeah. I don't care. So, let's play one more. This will be fun. So, I actually... I like the idea of starting Pinker Chinarangaru again. With Calyrex. Attacker. The problem is, this is an example of a time where they might actually reset the trick room on me. Should I actually call it? Probably not. Like, I probably want to actually set my own trick room up this time. But, knowing all things considered, they very well could just make the right play and reset the trick room on me. Which wouldn't be great, I'll be honest, but it could happen.
neither of those are stack attack. One of them, however, does fat damage to me. They could actually reset the trick room with me, you know. But I'm gonna try to call that they don't. I believe that we can survive a Dragon Energy. Even better, even better, dude, I'll take that. Even better. You set off there with a weakness policy. If, I mean, they want to switch out in Cinewar, right? Like, but whatever they do, it's going to take a lot of damage. Like, they don't want to take that damage on Reggie. They don't want to take that damage on uh, Lunala. So this is a rough position, I would say.
What we have to do though is we have to hope we have enough trick room left. And what I could expect them to do is if I have one more turn of trick room left, they're gonna want to double protect to waste it. So what I'm gonna do is something really uh, risky. And I'm going to double trick room, hoping that they double protect. Do I play this game? Uh, you got got. In case I need it for the thumbnail. You love to see it. You love to see it. Now I just sound like that's a plus one, but you do love to see that. So, yeah, um, that was three opponents that we made cancel, just based on being as boys with Pinkerton and the other boys, and it worked, okay? It worked. Don't tell me it didn't work. So we made three opponents cancel. We didn't make the other opponent cancel because we made the wrong play turn one. But we were as boys. And that's what matters. If you don't know what I mean by being as boys, it's because you don't know me personally and you don't know my friends. So, sorry. But we are as boys. So, yeah, that, that worked. That definitely worked, um, and that was that team was a lot of fun. So, um, I'll definitely think about using this team again. Um, usually, I only do two teams or two videos from another person every month, but we did not have good success with that Chansey team. So, we'll think about using this team again. But till the next vid, I hope that you guys enjoyed, and uh, yeah. Thanks for being here. Consider giving me a scribe. A scribe. Give me a scribe. Uh, give Gigawatts a subscribe. Peace out, y'all. Yeah, have a good day. Hope that you enjoyed.